guys and gals. Got the uh, baffle. I went ahead and added a, another layer. So we got three three quarter inch layers plus the little top part for the uh, recessed end. So uh, what I'm doing right now is pretty much got this one piece of wood here cut out for the bottom side. Well, it's for the top side, but it will be for the bottom. As you see, having to cut these out, I have to grind them up, make them semi smooth and all. I mean, they ain't got to be perfect, but I'm uh, cutting these out of this quarter inch um, flat plate. And I marked each one set for the uh, top and bottom all the way down. But as far as that goes, it's a fun time cutting these out. It's when I need a plasma cutter for sure. I'm just using this and one of these just for with the metal blade on it. But it's still uh, still a pain in the you know what. But uh. I figured I'd just show y'all on that step here what I've uh, got going on, and uh, I'll get to the uh, the next part and the uh, okay. The so we got here. these uh, little pieces here cut out, which was a bitch, but right now drilling holes in these. Got 20 of them, so 60 holes. That's good stuff. All right, <clears throat> basically. Taking this washer, coming to the outer sides of uh, basically where this washer meets with the edge of the steel and making a dot right dead center. Doing that for all of them. Then drilling a five, uh, quarter inch and then a um, three eighths hole in each one of these. <laughs> ah, excuse me. All right, but. <clears throat> yeah, just uh, another uh, process of uh, getting these uh, drilled now. But yeah, these should do the trick. Should be plenty. Um, you know, as as you see, what I do within the next steps and all for this baffle, you'll understand more if you don't already. But yeah, so let's keep okay. it going. Been sick for the past uh, week with sinus infection. Actually, working on this, cutting metal and grinding into the side of the wall on this, where I added an extra sheet of birch onto the baffle. Um, I got, like I said, sinus infection, so haven't been out here working on this much. Been getting over that, but I worked on it some tonight. Uh, I got all ten bracing poles in. The back one's back there, in the very back is um well this was this is the back of the wall, but back there um to the front, those have been spot welded. I gotta pull those out and get to uh welding them up. And then once I get those welded up, I can then secure them to the baffle by bolting and then screwing them to the floor, as you see, the floor should be stout enough. Therefore, this pole going up onto the underside of this baffle should be pretty stout. It's basically just allowing all this what's been cut away that the subs are uh, being held by now to keep from the baffle to flex. And we don't want that. Um, there's a lot of weight that goes on, especially when you put power to it with motor force and all. That's uh, you'd be surprised what a uh, a lot of power and sub motor force can do when it gets they get to jumping so never underestimate bracing you've seen on builds and everything they uh it's always better to have more than not enough especially once you finish it you don't have to go go back in and uh have to you know add to it it's harder that way but uh yeah so i figured i'd give a little update here and uh should be uh on to the next thing and that would be let's see here got I'd have that 
thinking about is going to be throwing the back of the wall on. Um, I need to start maybe possibly prettying up the inside. With, I need to buy some of that black uh, acrylic plexi that I, well, that, you know, the mirror stuff that I got in my doors and I had in my last build uh, so that I can uh, get to it and everything uh, with this back off. But that, uh, that should be the next uh, next step. I might actually start wiring up. Let's see here. Got some uh, got some 12 gauge green and black speaker wire from Sky High. So I'm gonna rerun. I had this right here from last time. I'm gonna just go ahead and rerun um, the doors and stuff back to the where the amps are gonna be on the side. But uh, other than that should be good to go but figured i'd uh like i say check in with y'all and let you know what's going on so i appreciate you watching